Whenever we think of mithai, we think of something that is sweet and sugary. And for the right reasons. After all, it adds a lot of calories in our body. But what if I tell you that that is not the case with laddu? In fact, it has gawa hai ki laddu never started off as a sweet meat. It was made for medicinal purposes. Yes, treatment and not indulgence was the main purpose of coming out with laddu. Laddu? Think about it. Whenever we think of laddu, we always think of motichur ka laddu. Because this laddu is available at any and every mithai wala. The word motichur literally translates to crushed pearls. You can also call it bundi. The process of making moti chur or bundi is pretty simple. It's made from besan. But laddu is like methi ke laddu, besan ke laddu, dinka ke laddu and til ke laddu. They not only satisfy your sugar rush but are also very good for your health. These laddus are a very healthy replacement to your sugar loaded laddus which can actually be very problematic to your health. One thing common about all these laddus is that they are specifically consumed during winters as they provide warmth to your body. Methi ke laddu are made with methi also known as fenugreek Greek in English. The sugar content in this laddu is extremely low. In fact, when you taste this laddu, it's going to taste bitter as opposed to tasting sweet. Daily consumption of this laddu is considered very healthy. It helps you with constipation, helps maintain your sugar levels and also provides extreme energy to your body. Dink laddu or dinka ch laddu as Maharashtrians call it is extremely famous in Maharashtra. The main ingredient in this laddu is dink which is edible gum. It's made with a mixture of dink and dry fruits. Similarly, we have besan ke laddu which is made from besan and rava ke laddu which is made from rava. The name of these laddus derive from the ingredients they are made with. Remember the process of making these laddus are the same. You just have to make the batter and turn them into small balls. Laddus are widely distributed during festivals, but there is one laddu which is extremely festival specific. We get to have this laddu during the month of Makar Sankranti. Yes, you guessed it right. It's the til ke laddu, which is made with a mixture of til and jaggery. The Hindu mythical god Lord Ganesha is always shown carrying laddu in his hand. Well, what to say? It's not only our favorite, but it's also the god's favorite. I love laddu. Now if you think about it you can make laddus of any and everything because of which laddus leave a great space for innovation i have seen laddus which are covered with rose petals chocolate shavings and choco chips shahi laddu from the state of persia which is made from figs dates and vegetable seeds are very famous similarly down south coconut laddus are very famous and up in the north puffed rice laddus are very famous now you know more about laddus than you previously did I am Mithai Wala and I am going to see you in the next video. Have a Mithai.